Remember back in the day when Loki was supposed to be a one-off villain for the first Thor? And then they're like, well, we can work him into the Avengers. And then Thor 2, and now he has a series coming out. And now he might be back for Thor Love and Thunder. One-off. So Thor Love and Thunder is shaping up to be a uh, big film, considering everything it seems to want to tackle, from Thor to Mighty Thor Jane Foster to multiple new characters to older characters to Loki returning, possibly. Uh, so what happened was Taika Waititi was doing the, uh, you know, watch along thing for Thor Ragnarok and he was asked questions. And, uh, you know, usually when they're asked about stuff, they uh, tend to play coy or they talk a little bit more about some of the elements that might make an appearance down the road. So when Taika was asked about Loki, he said, he can't say whether the character is back for Love and Thunder, which means yes. That means yes, in case you can't read between the lines. Um, every time they do this, it's saying, you know, well, I don't want to lie to you, so I don't want to say no. And then when it happens, you guys call me out on it. And then some guy makes a 23 minute video calling me a liar and why you should never listen to this. And then yada, yada, yada. And then they're going to go hunt through old tweets and try to expose me and all this. They, they just don't want that. So he's saying I can't say because, well, more than likely right now, they're developing, you know, everything at the same time. And depending on the schedule now, changes, delays, this could change at any point. So more than likely, they have an idea for how to use Loki right now. But they just haven't really uh, come up with a good solution to will he stay in here or will things change due to the development of his series? Which Loki? How do we handle this? Is this a multiverse movie? You know, there's so many factors going into it, we don't know. So again, it's a wait and see approach, but it sort of makes sense that they're going to use Loki again. I mean, girls love Tom Hiddleston, they love Loki, so if you can add that in there, I guess they got the sex appeal for Tom Hiddleston in there, and that's what you need, I guess? So yeah, Loki. Uh, do you guys want to wanna see Loki back some more? In another Thor film, what do you think they'll do with him? Think he'll uh, scheme against Thor again? I hope not.